it's very common for a transmission to be designed to fit behind various size engines. This can involve modest and not so modest design changes. Additionally, it's common to see manufacturers redesign parts for increased durability. For these reasons, the constant changes in parts and their interchangeability can be a real challenge for the rebuilder. Dale is in the shop and he's ready to show us some design changes with the CD4E transmission and their interchangeability. One of the incorrect part interchanges he's going to cover could easily cause a converter clutch slip code P0741 that will not go away. Dale? As most of us are already aware, the torque converters for the CD4E transaxle are different in overall height depending on the vehicle's engine size as shown in figure three. The difference in overall height is approximately five-eighths of an inch with the 2.5 liter converter being taller than the 2.0 liter converter. What we sometimes tend to overlook is the related mating parts when a change of this magnitude occurs. In this case, it is the turbine shaft and the oil pump drive shaft that also change. Both parts are approximately 5 eighths of an inch longer for the 2.5 liter engine to accommodate the added thickness of the converter. Notice that the 2.5 liter turbine shaft has longer splines than the 2.0 liter turbine shaft which is the best means of identification. These changes and dimensions are shown in figures one and two. If the 2.0 liter shaft is mistakenly installed with a 2.5 liter converter, the result will be code P0741 stored in memory and excessive converter slippage after operating temperature is reached. The reason for this is the shorter 2.0 liter shaft allows only a very small portion of the pilot of the shaft to protrude into the bushing in the 2.5 liter converter. This creates a leak of apply oil into the release side of the converter and thus the slippage. All we have to do is exercise a little extra care when selecting replacement parts for this location depending on the vehicle's engine size. Also, under the extra care category, I want to point you to an excellent article by Bob Warnke in the September 2001 issue of Transmission Digest magazine entitled CD4E converter clutch codes. This article has several tests including but not limited to a CD4E converter bench test. We have experienced several remanufactured and new converters that turned out to be the root cause of converter slip codes being set. This bench test would have eliminated those concerns and save the technician many hours of diagnostic time. This article is also available at no charge on our website at atsgmiami.com or atsg.biz.